What is going on YouTube? It's your boy Thunderbite29 here, and yep, I am back today with another video. And today, we're going to do a different kind of video. As about one year ago, I had made my Tinder rant talking about sex bots and gold diggers. And since it's been about a year, I want to do kind of like a follow-up video of that, and kind of a follow-up video of the video I uploaded last month talking about the problems with social media. Because this is an issue that's been going out of control within the last couple of years. And nobody is hardly talking about it. So without further ado, let's begin, shall we? I don't know if you guys have been seeing this quite frequently like I have, but ever since I graduated high school in 2020, I have come across at least a thousand of these people. These people come from everywhere. They come from your Xbox Live messages. They can come from your Snapchat, like this right here. Instead of having a casual conversation, like saying hi or hello, they just jump the gun and send you links to pornographic websites or send you nude photos. They sometimes do that or they'll sometimes be like, hey, you want me to be a sugar mama or some stupid bullshit like that. Or if you're on Instagram, sometimes they'll randomly tag you into a post. Congratulations, you want a free iPhone. Even though 99.9% .9 of those accounts are complete bullshit. Hell, even every once in a while. You can even find them in my YouTube comment section. And a lot of the people that do this are either in their 30s, 40s, or 50s at most. And they're doing this to a bunch of young teenage kids and young adults. They do this to purposely mess with the minds of young men. To give in to their demands. Like giving them money or having phone sex or whatever. Like... What the fuck is wrong with these people? And bots aren't just in the US as some people would think. They come from almost every corner of the globe. Like, I've seen Russian bots, French bots, Argentine bots, Guatemalan bots, even Canadian bots. Like, this shit is getting out of control. And what's sad is, nobody is taking the steps to mention this or call this out in any way. Hell, even if you try to block them on social media, because all they will do is just make another account, and that's it. Well, apparently, as of right now, Instagram is the only social media platform that has made a new feature when you block somebody, you can block all the accounts that they create. And how that works is, say you block an account, but the person tries to make another account, but if it uses the same phone number or email from the account that was blocked their new account will be blocked from that user as well. Even though I criticized Instagram for its censorship and stuff, this is the one thing that it did right. And I think other social media platforms should follow suit because this is an issue that's getting out of hand and it's just been getting worse and worse as each year goes by. This has become a serious problem on social media. In fact, this has become a big problem to our society as well. These people are serving no good purpose to social media. These people are extremely dangerous. These people are nothing but piece of trash. They're disgusting human beings. I don't know why they are constantly doing this. And the worst part is, they're not doing it just to people like me. They're doing it to young teenage kids. Like, what are they doing this for? Why are they constantly begging young adults and young teenage kids for money Instead of going out and working and earning it themselves like they should be doing. And why do they constantly take time out of their day just to add random people they find on social media and send them links to pornographic websites? Like, what are they doing it for? These people are just absolutely disgusting. They're nothing but pieces of trash. And they need to be held accountable. What triggered me into making this video in the first place? It's dealing with two of these people 12 hours before recording this video. And they literally said the same thing. Even if they say all this random stuff like, Would it be my sugar mama? Even if you question them, they're like robots who follow the same programming. And worst of all, it's not just one person. There are several dozen of them all across social media. These bots just need to get lives, get out in the real world, get some sunlight, and actually meet real people. But what do you guys think about all this? Has this happened to you? Tell me in the comment section. Like this video and subscribe if you agree. And thank you all so much for watching. 
And thank you all for the continued support, and I apologize for not uploading that much lately. You all are the best. As we now begin to slowly close in on 3,660 subscribers. I love you all to death, and thank you all so much for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more. Share this video and click the bell if you don't want to miss another one. And until next time, I will see you all in the next video. And this is Thunderbite29, signing off.